Hello, hello, hello. I hope that you're fine. Uh, today, uh, I'm going to show you uh, uh, how you can take uh, your writing that may come from, uh, you know, your book or from an article that you are reading, a hard copy or either even a YouTube video that you are watching. We, we're going to see a demonstration of how you can take those mathematics or those writing from picture and uh, put it back to latex um, and use it maybe uh, for your for your essay or or, or for your your thesis or for whatever article you are writing that use mathematics and some complicated symbol that you like to put in in latex but before we go uh, it may be your first time to come across our, our video i would like to invite you to like my channel in this way you just go on your your, your youtube as you are watching this video uh, probably if you, you you never like the the channel you will see uh, uh, this uh, uh, kind of uh, uh, red the, the, this red uh, sp uh, place where you can just uh, click there and uh, from there you you will be able to, to subscribe to to this channel and uh, better than that you can uh, also click on this uh, 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 on this symbol here right there and uh, you'll be able to, to get notified every time that a new video come up uh, and uh, you will never uh, miss uh, uh, those video that uh, we, we are doing and will be doing in, in future so here we go uh, let's go uh, to the, the main subject of uh, our video today as I said early we, we're gonna see this software uh, and see demonstration of how you can pick those uh, mathematics that come from a, a paper that you're reading, a picture that you have, a YouTube video that you're watching. Uh, and this software is named MathPy. Uh, and uh, yeah, you, there is a couple of, uh, of, uh, 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 of setup that, uh, uh, that need to be done. Uh, okay, uh, sorry, it MathPy. Math yeah mad pigs yeah so uh, when you open it uh, 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 it's amazing to see uh, the, the, the presentation page and I, I was just amazed when I, I came across this uh, this uh, this this website and this software I have it in my computer so the first step uh, obviously is to be able to install it in in your computer I don't know what what going on with uh, the network because um I kind of uh, okay hope that everything is okay yeah here we go so you see uh, the, the, the home screen say already convert an image to latex convert an image to latex and you you have uh, down there some of popular distribution like uh, Mac OS Windows or Ubuntu so uh, I'm a un Windows user, I, I, I went just right there. I download the the executable uh, a file and I kind of install it on 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 my computer. But if you are using Ubuntu or um, MS Desktop or whatever you are using a Linux distribution, you kind of just do the same thing. You go to Linux. Um, but here for my friend from Ames that maybe are you watching this video um, you, you 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 don't have uh, an authorization to to install such a software in ems a desktop you need to ask uh, a permission from the the it office if they will give you but you can kind of install it in uh, your, your own computer and uh, yeah so there, there is a, a line of code that uh, you will see uh, immediately when you click on uh, the distribution that uh, you would like to 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 use for uh, with this system but with windows straight forward just next next and you use it okay so let's now go to the demonstration of how one can use this software uh, as i was saying my network is not very good today for uh, installing such a, a software when you are using uh, a linux distribution uh, uh, let's say you have a ems desktop or you want to install this software because you need to install it before to be able to use it you just come to install and uh, the the they kind of giving give you uh, uh, the, a command line to to type on on your terminal to be able to 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 access the uh, the, the, the software. 
okay uh, the network is not very good um, i'm just gonna show you a first demonstration of how this software work practically enough talking let's go uh we will start by one of my writing uh, uh yet uh, as I, I was taking a course uh, uh i think it was a julia course and um there is some equation over there you can see uh, i think that uh, the screen is not completely uh, to start let me uh, kind of uh, reshape it sorry for doing it live uh, okay so what we are going to do this is like a picture that let's say it's a picture of an article that uh, you have in your computer and we just take a screenshot because this those are uh, some of my writing and let's say that i'm interested of having uh, this equation wt equals zero or two in winter or in summer and i would like to have it as a latex code to to be able to to put it in my latex when you have the software installed in your computer if you are a mac user you need to do Control alt and m like uh, if you are windows user Control alt and m and uh, it will pop out uh, as you will see uh, uh, a certain um, uh, wizard that will lead you on how to select the equation or the, the part of uh, the picture that you like to translate in latex but if you are a mac user it's the same thing you have uh, uh, that mac command and uh, plus control plus m so i'm a user you, you uh, windows user i do control alt and m yeah you see it's kind of freezing my 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 screen and from there i'm just gonna select what i need i need this one in latex form let's see oh recognize failure that not good for a presentation isn't it i think it's something to do with uh, uh, my, my my network because it's really bad over here right now okay let's try to take this one down okay we'll do the same thing and we select and here we go wow this is serious um i think uh, it's asking me to zoom is too small so sorry that you will not be able to see a, a certain part of the screen but i'm basically going to do the same thing uh yeah selecting this here we go this is what i wanted the derivative of v uh, over derivative of t but you take it as bt is wt plus v minus you know my writing skills are not great and that's why you have this kind of stuff so you just copy this one and if you are a latex user you just take a latex something like this and you paste what you just get from the software you run it here you go you have your mathematical symbol that are coming directly from uh, an image let's let's try it again uh, control alt and m every time but now go with this same uh, stuff that was refusing Harry because probably of many things yeah it is working now that probably my my compete my, my my network or something like that and now you can see that it's giving also the confidence how confidence it is to say that the writing that uh, uh, the, the writing is translated in in latex and the picture that you scan so uh, it, it's not very confident but it's exactly somehow what is inside my writing it's not confident because i'm not writing well it's obvious uh, because also this one is not d as you can see it's zero but anyway we can do it so the same thing obviously it will work you just do kind of copy paste huh as jordan says one of uh, my twitter here i say copying and pasting is a skill now you're gonna use it in a good way so let now look at another example i have this course of computational algebra that is full of matrices and whatever let's say it would be interesting if you have a matrices writing in the paper instead of writing uh, you know uh, selecting uh, a certain column of the matrix you know it's not obvious to write a matrix on on that text there's a lot of things to do uh, for example just quickly i'm just gonna show it maybe it may be interesting for someone if you want to add a matrix you just come wizard and uh, uh yeah it's, it's a 
supposed to be somewhere quick quick tabula or quick tabling or quick array and from there you get stuff you put your array and uh, it, will gener it will generate a, a code for that matrix or that array from this but it's not always obvious if you have big matrices or if you just write your matrix in paper you need to repeat again we need to automata uh, to, to make automatics everything that uh, uh, you know that 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 doesn't go through our time we need to concentrate on more important things for example in this case let's do the same thing control alt m and i would like to have a latex representation of this matrix yeah here we go the software yeah it found it it's 77 but it's seven yeah i'm not writing great as i say so so the confidence is not great let's try to take maybe this one maybe the writing is much more better uh i'm just taking the matrix i'm not taking the m and let's see yeah this not true at all you see even there's no confidence because of the writing let's look at something else um that will be interesting let's look at this one it's a little bit a more complicated expression but um, uh, let's see what the software can do with it um okay i select this one and let's see oh recognition they say uh, the image is too small let's try again yeah uh, okay okay let's stop there and see yes alpha 4 and this and you have your stuff uh, I, I i agree that uh, it's not impressive so far maybe when i can say it's not accurate how to do works and yeah it's basically due to uh, the way i'm writing but let now finally look at uh, a youtube video a really live youtube video i i to gain time i just selected one video there are many on the internet when someone was talking about differential order uh, first order linear differential equation and the kind of explaining what is going on so i can kind of play the video for 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 a few seconds yeah, let me check it's sure it the sound. don't need it yeah you can see and he's kind of writing math over there uh, writing stuff and i say wow this equation is amazing i don't have time to write it let me copy it you just stop the video there and you call your software control alt m as i say you need to install it um, and you just take the part of the code that you like this is more much more clear let's hope that it will work yeah exactly 100 percent accurate the writing is great the writing is clear and the software is doing great as well the only thing that you need to do copy and paste you just copy and you paste it in latex and here you go you have everything and you can continue thinking about you know doing great stuff but you don't lose time in trying to to write again let's say let's do a, 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 a later demonstration let's say we need to we need to take all this one we do the same thing m and uh, this last one is not very clear let's see what you will find and um, yeah what is this yeah you see 90 percent accurate that amazing isn't it so uh, this is the kind of stuff that you can do using this software and uh, I, I could not uh, go to the website and show you many things because of uh, uh, the network issue and uh, you can go the, on Google as I did early just type mad pigs you you will uh, have you will be able to to, uh, uh, to download it in your Linux or in your Windows and do the kind of demonstration that I did here I don't have any license they didn't ask me any money free of charge so far just use it and uh, yeah hope that you like the video it was great to, to have you guys around and uh, again if you were not yet uh, a member of this family as those who subscribe to this channel i will invite you to go to your youtube and to just click to that red button and click also to that bell now to be able to be notified every time that we are online goodbye and see you very soon next time
拜。